Causes of Noise Pollution Noise pollution is a severe problem that affects nearly every industry in the world and the causes of noise pollution are also hard to know. It can come from many sources, including construction equipment, airplanes, and even music festivals. There are many problems caused by noise pollution, for example, it can lead to insomnia or hearing loss and interfere with emergency services like 911 calls. This article will discuss the causes of noise pollution and how you can reduce its effects on your life. Noise pollution caused by transportation. Exhaust from cars, buses, and airplanes can be a significant source of noise pollution in urban areas. People living near busy roads or airports may experience sleep disorders and increased blood pressure due to the constant din of traffic passing by day after day. Noise is measured on an A-weighted decibel scale where sounds above 115 decibels are classified as dangerous for human health if exposure lasts more than 15 minutes per hour. A lot of people don't realize the noise pollution that is caused by transportation. Cars, trains, planes, all make a tremendous amount of sound and can even be harmful to our hearing if we're in their proximity for long periods. This means it's essential to keep on top of this kind of thing because you never know what might happen down the line with your ears and other health problems like heart disease or obesity due to lack of exercise from living in an urban environment. Where being outside isn't safe enough. Noise pollution caused by industries. The factories in my city are never idle. I have to wear earplugs because the noise is so loud that it hurts when they go off late at night or early in the morning. It's too bad, considering how many people get headaches from this constant racket around our town and the other cities nearby. The loud screeches of factory alarms ring through every day like a death sentence for citizens who cannot escape them while working indoors with headphones on their ears as protection against hearing loss caused by prolonged exposure to high decibel levels. This could be reduced if more legislation was put into place regulating hours during which these machines can operate. Noise pollution caused by industries is so harmful that it has been coined the sixth sense. Inhabitants of industrial areas are forced to endure screams, air-piercing moans, and shrill screeches daily. It takes its toll, frustration levels rise while health problems arise from sleep deprivation or lack thereof due to all the noise at nighttime hours. When people do finally get some respite during daytime hours when there's less activity in factories as opposed to nights where our work never ceases, they can't help but be enticed into drowsiness with their eyes closed thanks to the buzzing flies incessant humming sounds, which irritates them after not being able soundproof their homes properly against. Noise pollution caused by construction. It's the beginning of a new construction project here in our town. I can't help but be excited about what it will bring to the area, yet at night when they're working and all that noise is surrounding me with its vibrations and echoes? It's just too much. If only there were some way we could get work done without disturbing everyone else so often. Most people don't think of construction as a cause for noise pollution, but it's often overlooked. Construction equipment like heavy machinery and jackhammers creates an incredible amount of sound due to their vibrations when operating. And because humans hear better at low frequencies than high ones, these noises can be incredibly disruptive and uncomfortable over prolonged periods or in confined spaces where there are no other sounds present to help mask out the offending noise sources. Noise pollution caused by loudspeakers. Noise pollution from loudspeakers can cause stress and anxiety. Mental health experts recommend practicing various activities to maintain your mental well-being, such as exercising, meditating, or even listening to classical music for 30 minutes each day. However, while it is essential not to be sedentary too often, some people are at increased risk when exposed to noise levels above 60 decibels on an ongoing basis due to the effects loud noises produce in our brains. Therefore, we need more research on how different sounds affect a person's brain chemistry over time before they decide what kind of sound system would work best in their home or office space based solely on anecdotal evidence without consulting medical professionals. First, noise pollution caused by animals. The sound of a cat screeching in your ear at five is one thing. Now imagine being woken up by some other creature who has just killed its prey and screamed to celebrate the kill or mourn their death. For example, an owl's hoot echoes all across town while you're trying to sleep. Noisy animals can cause noise pollution. The sound of all the barking dogs is enough to make anyone's ears ring, and when you're trying to sleep, it makes things a lot worse. The constant sounds that come from these pesky critters are just too much for some people, they feel like their heads will explode if there isn't silence soon. However, some scientific studies show how this high-pitched noise can harm one's health in various ways, such as hearing loss or even cancer, since prolonged exposure could damage our cells, leading to tumor growth. Noise pollution caused by tourism. 
It is hard to keep a strict focus on work when tourists are constantly shouting at the tops of their lungs and in your face about what they want. In this busy world where everyone's voice counts for something, whether environmentalism or business, there has been an astronomical increase in tourism which unfortunately brings with it noise pollution from all over the globe. A recent study by the University of Miami has shown that noise pollution caused by tourism is at an all-time high. This finding was surprising to many people because it contradicts past research, which concluded tourists don't generate much in terms of sound levels and often choose destinations based on natural attractions rather than nightlife or music festivals. Despite this contradiction, researchers found a strong correlation between areas with higher numbers of hotels and resorts having more cars driving around day and night and increased construction sites from new building projects meant for vacation getaways. Causes of noise pollution are hard to understand but we all need to work together to control these causes. Noise pollution caused by mining. The sound of dynamite blasting, the roar of heavy equipment, and constant noise from mining operations are creating a profound hearing loss for many people in places like Sishan. The noisy sounds emanating from mines are causing an alarming number of ear-related injuries and exacerbating existing conditions such as tinnitus. The risk to one's auditory health doesn't end with a single blast either. Staying too close can cause permanent damage over time, leaving those affected entirely unable to hear anything but low frequencies. The mining industry creates a considerable amount of noise pollution. The workers roar machinery, jostle with heavy materials, and suffer from hearing loss due to the high decibel levels on site. They are even exposed to toxic substances that can cause irreversible lung damage over time, such as silicosis or black lung disease because they breathe in excessive dust particles every day while working underground. Noise pollution caused by wind turbines. The wind turbines produce white noise that is problematic for people's sleep patterns and can be disruptive. Wind turbines are a popular source of clean energy, but they also cause some problems with the local environment, such as noise pollution. The blades make an annoying whirring sound which has been shown to disrupt restful sleep in nearby residents. Wind turbine blades are noisier than the rest of the wind farm which is often what nearby residents complain about. However, many people do not know that maintenance on many of these machines includes making sure all parts move together correctly, so it does not make too many vibrations or sounds when spinning at high speeds. Causes of noise pollution are important to know so that we can control them. Causes of noise pollution Noise pollution caused by urbanization. Did you know? Urbanization is causing an increasing amount of noise pollution. For instance, in just the past few decades, cities have seen a 50% increase in traffic levels, contributing to increased decibels and other sound-based measures of environmental stressors like heat waves and air quality. Noise pollution in the city and its effects on people are significant problems because there have not been many effective solutions found so far. The urban landscape has become a symphony of industrial noise. The cars, trucks, and trains that barrel through the city emit loud sounds to all who get within earshot at any given time, day or night. In addition, as more people flock into cities from rural areas in search of better opportunities, they bring with them their country habits such as hunting whenever possible without regard to what kind of animals are living nearby, causing an increase in gunshots heard daily across most major U.S. metropolitan hubs like Chicago, Chicago Tribune. In order to save our planet for future generations we need to reduce the causes of noise pollution.